And welcome back to Let's Play Baldur's Gate 2 2. We are on part 45 right now. And we are just about ready to leave Nashkel. We just killed the um, the Nashkel assassin called Nimble. And we got some cool stuff from him. We got, um, what do we get? Short sword plus one. And some boots of avoidance, which gives you a plus five to missile weapons. But we have to identify those. We're going to go to Bear Ghost. And I just returned that Greenstone Ring to uh, Joseph's wife. And we got about 800 experience. Minsk uh, leveled up to level 4. Pretty much just this Thacko reduced by 1. And he got some head points. That's pretty much it. And we're getting ready to go to Baragos to continue on the quest to find that bandit camp. Which is up here somewhere. So let's go to Baragos. Hopefully, we aren't waylaid. No, we're not. Good. Uh, well, hello, Mr. Fancy Pants. Okay, we gotta go to Jovial Juggler. And talk to this lady who's gonna come up to us, anyways. Uh, she pretty much is, is the main officer of the Flaming Fist and is in charge of taking down the Bannock Camps. So, you can just sell her your wolf pelts and your bandit scalps to her. She buys the bandit scalps for about 50 each. And the pelts are the same price as that guy in Nashkel. So whichever one you're nearest by, usually her, you sell everything to her. So, well, you can buy them back to for 33. <laughs> well, you just sell her bandit, your uh, bandit scalps and that's pretty much it. I got new and the smithy is closed because it's dark right now. So we're going to go ahead and Sleep in the felt post in. That's a red sheep and where's the felt post? This thing. Yes it is. Alright. Uh Transig's in here. Um if you read the scrolls from Mole, he says that his boss, uh Transig, he's like a mage or something, is staying at the felt post in and he has to you know report to him as soon as he's done. And he was also the boss of Nimble, who sent him there to kill you. So we pretty much just need to go here and kill this guy. Um, we're pretty much good. I don't really need any spells right now. I only have web. And that's pretty much it. But um, yeah, I just changed hers to there. So we're pretty much done. But we should be fine killing this guy without any spells because our party's beastly. I got it! I got it! So let's go in here and kill this guy. Yeah, he's right upstairs. So we'll go ahead and kill him, we'll have a couple of drinks, then we'll sleep it off, and then do some buying and selling at the smithy. Should be like right in here, I think. Uh, she can't go in shadows yet. I'm gonna have to. Klazu! Miranda! There he is. <laughs> All right, here's Transig. Pretty much just set your guys around him first uh, before you talk to him, so it'll be a pretty easy fight. Get rid of the hammer. Kaivin, you're going to switch to fire. And then once fire runs out, you're going to do plus one. Because I want to kill this guy. You guys can just sit back here and cast those. That's all you have. You have any scrolls? We're going to. Uh, we can cast. What does Burning Hands do? Yeah, that won't do much damage. I'll just have her use her bullets and just attack them that way. I don't think she has any good scrolls. Yeah, the same thing. Alright, so. Must be identified before you use it. Okay. Alright, well, let's get ready to kill this guy. We'll cast Chant too. Here we go. Oops. Chant, and let's do Detect Evil. Yep, he's evil. So now we know. <laughs> Which we already knew, anyways, but. I really don't know what the point of that is. Maybe if you're like in a dungeon and you want to know what's ahead of you, so you just cast that. 
Oh, you want a little trouble, huh? Why do you bother me? Stop where you are. We know what you're all about. Surrender and spill your guts. I'm not afraid of any mage. If you want to fight, bring it on. Okay. Go for the eyes, boo. Go for the eyes. Rask! All right. We're just going to go ahead and attack him, and it should stop him from casting any spells because we're just going to hit him, you know, before he can cast it. So there we go. Twelve spell failed. Kyvan's killing him. Minstead ten. Man, that midget a lot of health. All right. We have protection and wand of magic missiles. See if you can identify these. I doubt it. Let's see. Nimble, the money received. Transig. So we need to go to Pedvale or Larswood. And then that's where the camp's at, and that's by Tazok, who is also his boss. Now you can identify that. Well, we can just give this to you. Yeah, we'll do that. Put this ring in there. You guys can have any more rings, anything like that. Alright, good job, Kevin. Okay, um, give this to him. He don't need that. Let me give you the two. We'll trade that, no. Put that there, give him the 20, and Mintz can have the two. Since you're gonna be fine firing an arrow anyways. Alright, let's go sleep. So we just kill this guy, which was pretty easy. Got almost a thousand experience. I think I'm playing on normal, but I might increase the difficulty to just core rules. I got it, I got it. Um, in the normal mode, you guys won't explode and die. So I'm thinking of doing that. I'm not too sure yet. This guy has some good weapons. We're gonna go ahead and sleep. Okay, sleep. And let's identify. Avoidance. Let's get these armors identified so we can go ahead and sell them. Is that area armor? Oh, let's get this. Oh, it's full. Okay. Well, let's identify this. Started leather plus one. Chainmail plus one. Should be leather armor plus two. Yep. Uh, we'll give the boost of avoidance to Ash. And we'll give you these. There you go. There we go. Infrasion. You have to cast a spell. Oh, uh, you already got that taken care of. You can just wear this. And we'll give this helmet to her. There we go. This more cleric like. And Minsk, you can have that helmet. Ooh. Okay, well, we might sleep again to identify that. Alright. Carry that. Carry that. We're gonna have her wear that when she gets back to a thief and wield her short bow plus one. But until then, she'll have to deal with that. We still got a few things that need to be identified. Some chromatic orb, we'll get we'll get three of those. Those are always good. And we got web, so we're good to go. He has some magical sh shit we can buy. Amulet of protection. That's a maybe. Composite longbow, yes, definitely. Plus one. There you go, Kyvan, for being the the MVP of the party. You can get that. Now his Thacko should drop down to eight. Wow. That is really good. And we got Kyvan a new bow. 
He's very happy. It's Christmas all over, and they have not buy anything back, so. Okay, what do you have? What do you have? Two-handed sword, bastard sword, ooh. Let's get Ash a new chainsaw. Okay. Amulet of protection, hmm. Let's just get Minsk a second two-handed sword, just in case the other one breaks. Because I don't need a, a mace at all, because mace is a mace. And I think that's it. Let's see who can have an amulet. You can have an amulet. You have a ring. You can't, because that's already magical. You can't, you can't, and that'll free up a spot for this ring. So let's give this bastard sword to him. And that goes at 14 instead of, I think it was at 15 with this. Yeah, so that'll drop this stack a little bit. New chainsaw. Okay, we'll sell those four. We're good there. We'll sell that bow. Let's get these in order. And I'll just buy that amulet just for her. Because she wants one, because she has nothing. She's in a ring or anything. So here you go. Here's $2,000 spent. There we go. Drop by one. And then you have that. Your uh, dexterity is extremely low. It's only 13. Hers is at 18. So that'll help out her armor class. All right, let's go to the smithy and actually sell some stuff. And we'll probably buy a couple more things. So got Kevin a new bow, Ash a new chainsaw. The smithy. Um, Bramwin, she can just keep casting her spiritual hammer spell. They don't really need anything else. Um, Put command right there. You can have web. That's all she has. You got sleep. That's good. That's all you got. Elminster. Oh, Chloe first. Where is that? She just tells you about um the uh, lady who buys the scalps from you, which we already heard. Yeah, he just tells you about the bandit camps, which we already know, so... I guess if you came north of Baragos and just came south, you would talk to them that way, but we came from the other way, because that's just what we do. Who are we waiting on? You, where are you at? She's lost. Come on. And once we're done with this, we'll probably just head straight to the friendly arm in and get rid of Samuel because I don't want him to die and we can lose our rewards and stuff from, from the quest. Right, go inside. Well, hello, Mr. Fancy Pants. Alright, let's talk to him. I can make whatever you wish for a wee little bit more than me competition. Okay, start a leather, don't need that, don't need that, don't need that. Composite bastard sword. See what he has for sale. No. Nope, nope, nope. I might get her a warhammer just to carry it around. Yeah. Get you some bolts, some bullets, I mean. Ooh, small shield plus one. Alright, and this will end this part, so go to the next one, and I'll see you on part 46.